Welcome to Kid Crew. Ew, that porta potty's gross. And there's someone in there? Dad, at least wash your hands. But there's no soap. What? Ugh. This is the dirtiest porta potty I've ever seen. Kid Crew Porta Potty, I'm gonna call that company. They need to clean this up right now. Good thing he's got a septic truck and trailer ready. How stinky is it? Uh, very. There's toilet paper everywhere. It's out of soap. And it's even attracting wildlife. Here he comes. Shift into high gear. Hey, I wonder what he's going to do with that trailer. There he is. Oh, I'm so glad he's coming. Pull up to the messy scene. Thank you for coming so fast. That porta potty is a mess. No problem. Let's get to work. He needs to get all that toilet paper out of the way before he can pump out the tank. Done. <laughs> it looks like the porta potty tank is full. Good thing his truck has a huge pump. Grab the hose and stick it right into the toilet bowl. Then turn on the pump. It's putting up a fight. The tank is really full. Whoop, there it goes. And it slides into the truck. Turn off the pump and stow the hose. Now he needs to restock the supplies. Fresh toilet paper. And let's fill the soap dispenser. Take off the lid. Then pour in the soap. Glug, glug, glug. Wow. It's full. Then pop on the lid. Ta-da! What a transformation. Wow, that looks fantastic now. Thank you so much for cleaning it. I think I'm gonna try it out. Well, the kid crew knows from experience that it's probably best to vacate the premises. I'm out of here. Evacuate, evacuate. Just kidding. Wait, where'd he go? I didn't even pay him. But he's already gone with the empty trailer and he hasn't even hauled anything yet. All right, looks good. We're ready for renovation. All we have to do is order a porta potty for our crew. Let me order one right now. Hello? I need a porta potty. Stat. Here's a fresh one waiting at the playset. Pull up. Then load it onto the trailer for delivery. Whoa, that's a big load. Let's hit the road. The strong truck pulls it easily. I hope it's not too sloshy in there. Oh, here it comes already. Pull up through the delivery zone. It's such a tight fit. Perfect. Okay, ready? Yeah. Then unload into the marked area. Okay, is it all hooked up? Yeah. Okay, can I go? I gotta go. What about the soap? I don't need soap, I need a potty. Uh, mom and dad shouldn't be holding it so long. It doesn't need to be an emergency each time. Oh, oh great, soap, I need soap. Pump some out. <sighs> great. <sighs> that was a close one. Are you all set then? Hmm, I guess so. Then load up and drive off. Now here's how you can play along at home. These cars are careening towards each other. First fire repair shop. Slow down! And this one has a trailer that's hauling a porta potty, which is unfortunately full. Oh no! No! Neither one stopped. There goes the potty. And that's definitely not rain. It's pouring all over him. Boom! The impact knocked off the wheels. Don't run stop signs, kids. He needs a hose down. I heard a crash. Good thing he has this gear. I think it's going to get pretty stinky. There aren't any injuries, but everybody's covered in porta potty sludge. So this firefighter just needs to clean it off. This seems like an emergency, so luckily it's close by. Get out the hose. Walk up and check the driver. Now time to spray. This crank moves the piston and water flies out. Don't spray the car, spray me. Okay, he's getting him right in the face. Now he climbs out. 
and gets the rest of his body sprayed off. Oh, thank you. Now let's take care of that car. Good thing this repair shop is right there. Ew, I can smell the wreck from here. Well, let's load up in the tow truck. Pull out and back up to the wreck. Then tow it away and put it on the lift. Let's see. Oh, it looks fine. I just need new wheels and tires. Good thing they have a set. Turn the crank on the top to lift up the car. This wheel needs to come off. I've got the wrench. Attach it to the wheel and then push the lever. Perfect. Then here's the new one. Slide it over the axle and press on. Then do the rest. I love the black wheels. But take it easy this time, okay? He probably will. Nobody's gonna want a porta potty crashing on them again. And maybe put up the top for some more security. Thank you. Now this mess still needs to be cleaned up. Close the door. Then carry the porta potty back to the trailer. It miraculously doesn't look damaged. Let down the ramp. Load. And raise the ramp. Then drive off. I need a long hot bath. Now let's learn how it works. This is how a porta potty works. Let's go in. Porta potties have tanks built into the floor that need to be emptied periodically by a septic truck. This tube here is the vent that exits on the roof. Ideally, all the smells go out the vent on the roof and inside the porta potty stays pretty fresh. This latch locks the door and also shows if the porta potty is occupied. It's important to sanitize your hands after using a porta potty, so they're often built in. Can you help us in the driveway? I'm Where are you? Oh! Ah! <laughs> you little stinkers. Ah! Yes! Oh no! <laughs> used up all the TP. <laughs> don't, you have, don't you have any reading material? What? Like a magazine or a book or a what? newspaper? Yeah. Any mints? Yeah. You have any mints? <laughs> Wait, where is he? I think he's in the porta potty. <laughs> <laughs> And here's your mitten blooper. <laughs> They're trying to record, honey. <laughs> well, he is smoothing out the bogus. Yeah, he is smoothing it Our out. Our little steamroller. Yeah. We gotta add the contents of the porta potty. And what color did you think it should be? Green. Green? Do you think this looks about right? Okay. Right here, is Mountain Dew actually green, or is it just the bottle green? Uh, the bottle we'll find is out. green. I guess we'll find out. Yeah. Here, do you want to open it? Let's <laughs> put it in the potty. <laughs> right, uh, it's coming out the bottom. It's... Hmm. But there's it's, some, it's there's some drainage holes. It's certainly green. <laughs> okay, maybe can we go sideways like this? I feel like it's pretty obvious. Uh, maybe we'll just close that. <laughs> do do do. <laughs> what if you have like a shot of like, oh. like this? <gasps> You're so dramatic. Yeah, but you don't do that to tape measures. <laughs> Isn't that the whole point of a tape measure? Is that it goes not hard? Slidey? Let me get you one of the old. No, are you serious? You're gonna do that to it. This is why I have decoy tape measures, okay? To prevent, <laughs> I shouldn't have brought out my real tape measure. All right, looks good. We're ready for renovation. 
Sorry, I just did it again. You're in jail. It's the best kind of jail there is. Secret garden jail. I know mommy would sign up for a lifetime sentence if she could. Like without parole. What kind of crime do I need to commit? Because I'll do it. Oh, wow. Nice. It's always important to wash your hands after you go potty. <laughs> it turns out everyone's favorite kid crew is always has a potty in it. <laughs> but we're really trying to example good bathroom behavior and demystifying some of it. So hopefully it's helping you. Thank you for watching Kid Crew. Please like and subscribe.